Now, to see who goes first, I like playing rock, paper, scissors. Is that alright by you? Here we go. I'll pick this one. Da 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 da. Oh no! I think it's the same way I lost last time. <laughs> and then there's the rock. Yeah. There it is. I'll take slide. Sure. Oh no, you're good. Tap. Yeah. I just did. Shit, not kidding. Aww. <laughs> Dark, okay. Keep this over here. <laughs> Too edgy for the internet. <laughs> right. Gotta be careful. Ooh, that is dark. Dropping it down? No, no, no. Ooh, yeah. That's no good. I'm just showing off it, the showing the camera. So, we have our fundamentals. Getting all basic here. Hot amount of pressure being on camera. Okay. Okay. Um, you're up. Okay. Ah, it feels like a storm is coming. Hmm. That's turn. Yes. Faithless looting. Got it. Because they usually just kill all my <laughs> Life in the Lime Shambling Shell? Pastor? Good time coming. Creature you control enters, deals one damage to each opponent. Yeah. Alright. I see you. Flat, uh, dredge life One, two, three. Hmm. Just 18, no shock. I'm modern of you. I suppose. What is in the turn? We seem crazy. Things set up one day where it's like you can do like seven damage to yourself, turn one for some nonsense. The burn players rejoice, of course. That moment when you fetch, then shock, then thought sees, and then see that it's a burn player, and you're going, shit. Uh, I'm gonna, like, cool, I'm gonna pull the author of Bird, and then. It's it's special summoning itself, the Bird. Colonel Plunge and three goblin grenades. What the? <laughs> How did I not see any of that when I thought so? Hug? I had to check myself. Hug it up. Uh, two, three. Hey, buddy. Four. Took ya. That's the stuff. Mm. 
Yes, yes. Mike from the low? Mm hmm. Counter that against your hand and I'm not Mm. Let's see, seven in hand, so pass turn. Face three and prefix is insight. Reveal the top six cards, put up to two, up to three enchantments. Oh, okay. Oh, All the <laughs> Enduring renewal. Oh boy. Oh yeah, we're comboing. This is uh, fruity pebbles, isn't it? Okay. What? Yeah. No. Yeah, it's right. <laughs> and uh, modern fruity pebbles. Okay. Note to self: kill quick. In that case, um, let's see, actually. Lightning Axe, discarding Golgari Thug. Five damage. Time for some major hitting. One, two, three. Fetch, you're a 17? I mean, the DRG format is it one. The prefix thing was supposed to be a deal uh, here. It didn't come in the mail yet. Oh, I got you. And I really like seeing the enduring renewal there. That that makes me kind of happy. Yeah. I used to, when I first started, I found out about pretty couples, and I was like, this yeah. is the best thing ever. <laughs> How many, how many players these days actually know what that is? It Not, started in Apocalypse. So. It did, so... Well, I mean, I did. I, that started as an answer to tricks. And started the trend of naming decks after cereals. I think it was the first. Really? Well, yeah. tricks was, I think, the first. Is tricks? Oh, tricks is a cereal. Oh, and pretty that's pebbles. Right. Was that's right. That's why it was called that. Because the only thing that could deal with it. I think it was the '96 World Championships. I'm not sure. I honestly forgot that that was even a cereal. Um, for kids. So yeah. Like from the low. Crypt, crypt, crypt. <laughs> Obviously, play crypt. Mm -hmm. hmm. Hilarity. Hilarity ensues as I. Oh, God. On the last. the turn. Okay, okay. I was like, uh. Can crypt you do that stuff? I'm gonna take two. Okay. Yeah, that's good. So something tells me you won't be attacking. I keep doing that. As if that's actually what I'm supposed to do here. You want the troll. I want the troll. Oh, my God.
Hmm. Ends up being the same I like it. Well, maybe not. Maybe it's worth it. Phantasmagorian ability. Mm -hmm. Discarding one, two, three. Dredge back the Grave Troll. You're running, you're running ahead of the ball. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hey, New sort twenty. I'm eighteen. Oh, eighteen. Oh yeah. Sorry. I need to adjust that. So, Crypt of Agadine generates 9 mana. Mm -hmm. Let's see, does it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, yeah, 9 mana. We're going to spend 7 of it to flash back a spider spawning. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, 9 of those. Uh, well, actually... It, that one, uh, this only counts black oh, creatures, right, right, this right. counts all. So it includes one more creature. It includes a Golgari Grave Troll, so ten. Ten one two spiders. Spend the remaining mana on a Golgari Grave Troll with ten counters on it. And. Then I will pass the turn to you. Yeah, sorry. No, it just has regenerate. And dredge. Lots of dredge. Answered my prayers. So, 12, 15. Combat? Yes. In order to attack, 
This makes 12 mana. Right. So 14 mana, 7 can attack. Grave Troll, and 6 of the 1-1s, one one, or 1-2s, one will attack. Okay, take it. All right. I'm at two. Main two. Another crypt. Pass turn. Oh God. Okay, so no shock lands are out. Sorry, I'll just be brief. This is not helping at all. See, that's what I run into with all three. Once I've used all their effects, more or less, but I don't know what this is. Four is obvious. I want to see Softy Air starting to come out at some point. Bird, right, I'll take one. I think I can stop the barrage. I think you got this one. Yeah, I can't stop it. Alright. Uh, next guy. Let's go for it. Let's do it. Hey, hey, you look at those lands. I burned through them with that crit. Like, yeah, that was... There. I knew that I, I should have been, if not dead, at least in much, much worse shape. Um, as a result of that, but, you know. Oh, this deck kind of like your dad or your not. <laughs> it kind of goes in that direction. And click. You know, I, I guess it's just do 200 cash and I'll do three Modern Masters packs. And this has been Modern Masters. Time to go ahead. Time to go ahead. Time to go ahead. Have three packs. Jeez. And like my wife was like, you bought more cards. I'm like, here's, another, here's 200 dollars and here's another 500. She's like, all right, you, you win this round. <laughs> Okay. Interesting. I will run with it. Let's do this. No boy this time. Not this time. I'll do the same. Okay. Do you have something to do first, or just... Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Just having fun. That'll do. I'm going to play a Faithless Loot. I'm just putting my hand up right now. That one. Yeah, you're at 19. Okay. Okay. Two stinky nicks. And... Last turn. I'm going to take two. Okay. Which is 17. Drop a tremor. Tremors are good. Back to you. In the turn, cycle Street Wraith, replace the draw with the dredge. Nice. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. 
Okay. I will draw, not dredge. Pass turn. I mean, so I, if I should be dredging. I'm like, wait, am I doing this? <laughs> <laughs> I'm in a, a bit of an awkward situation right now with what's in my hand. Okay. Fourteen. Oh, gee, I wonder. Gee, I wonder. Okay, that was the decision I had to make. And, um, yeah, tap this. Press run. A lot of people wait. A lot of people wait. And I'm like, really? Yeah. If that doesn't tell you something about my hand right now. Right? Are you free up? Okay. Awkward hand is awkward. Got Jared, you're playing Matthew. Oh god. Cast a thug. Wait, man. Cast turn. Combat? Yep. Two? Two? Oh, excuse me, just one, sorry. <laughs> yeah, just one. You're at 13. Necroplasm? <laughs> End of turn, he gets a counter, there you go. <laughs> Still playing over here? We are. Okay. Nah, just come and make a round. Fair enough. Y'all oh, game three, I'm assuming? Yes, game three. What's the highest rarity on Magic Oh, I'm sorry, this is at the beginning of the upkeep. It's the end of turn that destroys stuff, so it's still the 1-1 one -one right now. So, beginning of upkeep gets a counter, end of turn, destroy stuff. So, my bad, just getting them mixed up. Trimmers, okay. And... Thank God. 
now that it doesn't matter anymore. Green man I get. Come back. Swing three. Ten. Shambling shell. Last turn. Fruity Pebbles. Lob Canter. Okay. It's it results. Um, that's you. End of turn. Lightning Axe. Discarding. <laughs> Life from the Lump? In response, I'll stack over the flag. Tap the relic. Okay. Need the lightning axe. The black is going to play it white. And we're going to What's the mode? Return target creature. Oh, I, I kill it and take damage equal to its, uh, to its toughness? Yes. In response? <laughs> Sacrifice shambling shell. Putting a counter. On. <laughs> Necroplasm? Mm -hmm. Okay, now, <laughs> my turn. Sheldridge? One, two, three? Did I add a counter? No, I did not. It's not a May. Four, four, that's pretty scary. The game ends up like three layers. Oh, I think. Shambling shell? This would have also fucked out the damage. Oh, yeah, okay. 17. Sorry. You're right. No, you're, you're absolutely right. Um, combat? Yep. Swing? Shambling shell? To make it four, and that'll deal you six, put you to four. Should be at three. Should be at three. I took one from the board that I'm trying to take. Oh, uh, it, it didn't resolve though, because I sacked my right. creature. Yeah. All right, and then pass turn. And then end of turn, it destroys all creatures with four, which is nothing. Yeah, shambling shell allows it to not kill itself.
Mary, Mary, in the flavor text, that's the name I was talking about. Oh. She'll show you in just a second. In the flavor text, right above the onion, perfect. Alright. artist, I'll take one. Let's turn. Dredge Dark Blast. One, two. Dark Blast, the Blood Artist. I'll take one. You'll gain one. Won't matter though. Yeah, because. Om nom 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 nom. Yep, that's it. What's up, man? Good job. Yeah, that really came out and I was super scared. We couldn't get. I was gonna take the birds earlier, yeah. but then oh, that no would problem. put two renewals in my graveyard and one in my hand, and if you had an answer for the yeah. one in my hand, that would be down to one. I figured I'd draw a land, but I didn't draw any. Oh, like, oh geez. Yeah, so the illness is good. It actually stops the spider tokens, but it doesn't kill them. Um, because they're one twos normally, so they'd still live, but no damage. And yeah. then it turns the zombies into. They usually have it in there for Splinter Twin. Yep. Oh, that's awesome against Splinter Twin. It really is. And since you have so many ways to go and get it, I don't blame you at all. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nineteen? Okay. If the curve's like yeah. two, three, but there's like the cancers and the birds help ramp it. That's true. It usually goes off like two, three, or four. I believe you. Just but that's if I'm throwing balls out. Sometimes I'll play more defensive and like wait yeah. out with the commands and the I have like that yeah, cool. and then, Man, you go in so much. And it goes and gets a creature back too. Yeah, the, the commands in this are really versatile. That was yeah. a sideboard. But uh, that's cool because I can get my hanger back yep. or my cancer back straight to the battlefield so I don't actually get around the wall. Yeah. Well, I can get around renewal because mm -hmm. it normally would go straight to the graveyard and then, yeah. Or I can save it or I can destroy a creature in a clutch situation. Yeah. No, I mean, that, that versatility is really good. Yeah. Yeah. I do like what you do with that. Nia Charm gives me get back this if I lose it. Mm -hmm. Well, anything really. What is a Nia Charm? I'm trying to remember. One of the modes is regrowth, right? Uh, let's see. Nia Charm is top all creatures and return any card. Oh, yeah. yeah. So that can get if they blow this up or something, I can retrieve it. Nice. Well, oh, yeah. This is what I sideboarded. I sided uh, Dark Blast in and J21. Sorry. No I problem. heard my name, so I thought that's what they were talking about. Ooh, yeah, your, your score anytime says your name. <laughs> Just every time anything happens. Oh, by the way! Uh, what's the song? I just can't say Okay. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah. Alright, so three Raven's Crimes to try to fight the combo. Oh, did you guys finish? We did. And then three Dark Blasts to try to deal with it. the one drop creatures. I got it. Just okay. two one though. Eight, two, one. He comboed off on me in game two and it was beautiful. Oh, and Jun Charm, too. Man, that was a sideboard. Maybe my favorite of the three charms. That was to blow out your graveyard or yeah. deal two damage. Can I look at that? I just wanted to charm it. You ever seen a fruity pebbles deck before? Fruity pebbles. I don't think so. Well, that's what he's running. Oh. He's, uh, he's a homebrew. Yeah. There was an old standard deck. Never mind. We'll, we'll get into that in a second. Essentially, it's this. So you got a two to one? Oh, yeah, I got a two to one. Either of those. Or either of those. Now, what I'm excited about is Battle for Zendikar gives us a. Uh, Eldrazi that costs X comes in with X counters, oh, so yeah. he can also be played for free. Now having all three of them, I can signal the clan to search for one of each mm -hmm. and get a win condition no matter what, because they all do the same thing. Signal the clan. That's right, because you get three creatures with different names, add one to your hand at random. Yeah, but it doesn't matter That's because, right, because they're and then one artist is getting Zulu Park cut from. Okay. And there's a lizard out there that for three mana who deals the damage when something comes into play. Mm -hmm. Also signal the clans. If I wanted to go that route, because I can search for either half of the win condition and then I deal like tutor and 
Is Death Creator... No, Death Creator doesn't... It gains you life. It doesn't make your opponent lose life, right? It's the one drop that humans doing like what? Like this in the art? Um, I I'll have to look into that because if he does do any coming or going damage... Yeah. I know that he either makes them lose life or you gain life. One of the two, when a creature dies. And if it's gain life, you're infinite, but you didn't actually win the game yet. Um, yeah. yeah. Do much against the deck. That's true. But it's neat, and I'm just surprised because this card was time shifted, and mm -hmm. I'm like, how has nobody abused this? Like, I was looking pretty... online, and some people were running like mono blue with like grinding station and stuff. Yeah. But this has like so much surge. These commands are super versatile. I think the trick to enduring renewal is that the downside, like if you're comboing off, it's awesome. If somehow you stutter. Um, the downside of it can be pretty substantial. Uh, when you draw a reveal, uh, if it's a creature, put it in your graveyard, otherwise draw a card. So you can kind of lock yourself a little bit. Yeah, but that's why I have like the Resolve Charm, mm -hmm. and the Naya Charm, and Colgan's Command to retrieve those creatures that are lost, and they serve other purposes, like this guy, Enchantment, or Artifact Destruction, That's right. and you know, I have some sideboard stuff with the same, but these are supposed to be idyllic tutors. I had one in my hand. If I had that in my hand, I would have felt more confident using it earlier. How many do you have in the deck, if you don't mind asking? These? Three. Right. I do, or I do like two. Three. Three? And because three is as many as you want? Yeah, just because like I don't want to get stuck with it. It's a sorcery. It's kind of slow, and when I'm like trying to go off, I'd rather slow play it and like try to control a little bit more with the charms and stuff. Fair enough. But and the ones I signed out. Oh, I'm sorry. What were you about oh, to say? I was just gonna say. Um, yeah, I can also search for impact tremors, which is great. Yeah. Um, eventually, when they come in. So I cited out some of my win conditions. Um, I cited out two armies and a spider, which left one of each uh, in the main or in the board. And then I cited out Phantasmagorian, just too slow. And limit sometimes it works, sometimes not. Yeah. Vengeful Pharaoh does actual nothing against you, I'm pretty sure. You're probably not attacking. You're, you're coming on. I did beat down one game, it was slow. Playing. Oh, nice. Well, I had two impact tremors and two blood artists out, and I had three anger back walkers in my hand and like six mana to blow. So I why was not? Just, right? I was just dumping them out, and then like I was out charmed one. And I had three lives left, so I, I thought taking one out for adding in some direct answers would be all right. Um, Dark Blast, unfortunately, does not. When you're actually trying to go off, it doesn't actually do anything. Um, yeah. Both your Wild Canter and your Hanger Back, one dies to state base, and the other you can stack in response. So it actually does not help you to have a Dark Blast if you're trying to come off. But until then, it kills the bird, it kills the Canter, it tries to slow you down a bit. So that's why I, I like Dark Blast. It can, yeah, the, the Canter and the bird. <laughs> I mean, I feel like right now I'm sort of relying on them to get me to turn four. Yeah. And like one game I kept, I had five fetches in my opening hand. I won, which is awesome. Which yeah. Most times I would never keep that, but I'm like, I'm just gonna thin out my deck and I'm gonna draw nothing but not like gas. But uh, yeah, like the last three games, like, well, not the one. Yeah. Like, well, even that game, I was struggling to get the mana out. Mm -hmm. And uh, but one of the games I played earlier, yeah. It was like instantaneous. It was turn three I had it. I had a bird, turn one, turn two I played uh, the battle or the impact tremor. Yeah. And turn three I had the bird and three lands. And enduring renewal started. He just looked at me like, what's happening? And I just dropped the hanger back and he's like, on turn three, what's going on? It was so funny to see your friend Yeah, check it out. See you later.